Hi YouTubers, it's George. I'm in the garage and um, having a go another go at the FRG7 and I thought I'd do some work checking a few things. Now currently I'm looking at this harmonic generator unit here. It's got a one meg crystal but the output of this it just has 9 volt and an output no no other connections to tuning capacitors so I'm just checking that this works and as I say it gives uh, the oscillator is 1 meg so the harmonics will be 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 right up to um, I think it's 32 meg so what I've done uh, to check that that's working because I haven't got an oscilloscope or anything I've got my man on height radio I've put it on 32 megs I've got a, a 20 plus DB attenuator and I'm connecting this up to a PP3 battery and uh, let's just turn this sound down yep. so we should see on AM uh, a signal if this is working right so we put it on and then we've got a signal can you see it on the screen 32 so if I go down to 20 meg then 20 meg right I'm on 20 meg now if I connect the harmonic jet, there we go I've got a signal on 20 meg so the harmonics generator circuit which is this on the FRG7 is working okay so it's given all the harmonics so I shall put that back together and put that back into the radio itself well I'm still doing some work on the uh, FRG7 uh, yeah I'm really struggling with this real challenge but I thought I'd approach it from a different angle so what I've done is I've um, disconnected this oscillator here which is transistor Q201 and according to this Q201 um, from one end of the variable capacitor to the other in other words full capacitance to, to no capacitance um, that the output of that oscillator is 55.5 to 84 meg and what I did I put my nano VNA on it and not my nano VNA uh, I've got one of these little spectrum analyzer things one of these pocket ones and on load with the circuit and offload I've set that frequency up so that's okay I then looked at the um, harmonic generator unit which is here and basically that generates um, it oscillates at one meg but it gives harmonics so it's one two three four five six seven eight right up to 28 megs out of that and again I've tested that out of circuit that works fine uh, I've actually done a realignment of the front end and all of these I'll, I'll show pictures of so I've done that so I do know that the pre-selector unit or the aerial tuner unit you could say that works fine and um, I've checked all the voltages once again put all these back and yeah I'm struggling a little bit still don't know what's going on uh, I've been going through the alignment process and the description 
and pass band circuit 55 meg balance mixer done that trimmers internal coils I've done all this alignment here as much as I can uh, I've done the uh, 50 most selective filter 109 to 116 I've done that just to peak it at 52.5 megs and uh, the lock level thing don't work uh, what's this one yeah I've been trying to do that and one thing or another and uh, the thing I st struggle with is the fine tuning scales and things like that I think it's this 401 to 402 it's the second IF tracking I'm going to have to work on and uh, that might be a bit of a problem and then there's a third IF but yeah it's the basic equipment I was going to buy a oscilloscope but I was outbid on eBay so I can't do that yeah I think this might be a scrapper <laughs>